Hey guys, Sarah here with more on the Rackstar. Today we're gonna to talk about switching out our lenses to switch to the four inch lens, which you're gonna need when you're doing any of our drinkware. So all of our drinkware is gonna have a custom fixture that you can match up with any of them. We're gonna do the 20 ounce polar mug with the handle here today. So the first thing you have to do is switch out your lens. This is our two inch lens that we've taken out and we replaced it with a four inch lens. This changing our focus point. So we're gonna actually be focusing four inches away compared to the normal two inch. You're always gonna want a manual focus and never let your laser auto focus. So I'll place our cups. They're, are gonna, they're already gonna be leveled and ready to go with the system. Now I'm gonna take my focus tool and I'm gonna find where it's gonna match. I'm gonna take my focus tool and center it right onto one of the cups here. And manually focus so it's just barely touching it. You wanna leave just that little bit of space to help cover more of the curve on each cup. So we have it focused our four inch all the way across level and ready to go with the with the Rackstar system. Gonna remove this. Now with the Rackstar, you're gonna get the digital file for all of our fixtures. So when you're placing it in that top left corner of your laser, you wanna account for the frame. So the frame is gonna be your top zero zero axis. And then here on each fixture, you're gonna see where you wanna move your, your X and Y axis. So it lines up and we're gonna be centered right onto the cup. So we're gonna be centered up and down and left to right here. Again, that's gonna be on your digital file. So you can snap your artwork right onto those crosshairs. So with it being the four inch lens, it's gonna look like your cups are farther away than normal. And that's just so you're able to cover all, you're, you're able to maximize your space on this. Here on our 20 ounce cups here, you're gonna get, I imported the art at two and an eighth. When it lasers, it's gonna come out to just short of two and a half. So when it's lasering, it's essentially falling on to the cup and breaking that radius and getting your max coverage that you can with a stationary cup. So now that our cups are done, we're gonna take them out, swap in four new ones, get these all cleaned up with some LA Awesome, Relid and Rebox, and then we'll have our next four done and keep that production going. So using that four inch lens, we really maximized our area to hit and fell within the parameters of that two and a half inches. To purchase a four inch lens, you're gonna to wanna to contact your laser manufacturer. For any more questions on the Rackstar, Give us a call at the number below or visit us online.